When do you, when do you get married? Uh, the 23rd of May. <laughs> Me, I'm still single. <laughs> so what's your name? Alex. Alex, where are you from? I'm from Rome, Italy, but I live in Melbourne, Australia. Nice. Yeah. So, uh, is this your first time on the island? No, actually, I lived here for nine months in 2017. How was it living in Boracay? It was different. Mm -hmm. More people, more international tourists. Uh, it's also more messy around the island. That was before the cleanup, by the way. So definitely now it feels much better. What do you like most about Boracay now? For me, Philippines, it's, just, it's about the people, mm -hmm. the colors, the music. I just love it here. I have good friends, so I come here quite often for that reason, yeah. What do you think is the reason why you're here in Boracay and staying here for life? Specifically now, I'm getting married. And so we came uh, just a few days before my family would come here. Mm -hmm. And then we'll celebrate all together. So it's a special place for me and my fiancé. And so we decided to get married here. So uh, it means a lot. When do you, when do you get married? Uh, the 23rd of May. <laughs> me, I'm still single. <laughs> um, any tips for me to, to have, a, you know, a special someone? I don't know. <laughs> Be yourself. If you're going to rate Boracay Island on a scale of 1 to 10, what's your, what is your rate? 10. If you're going to rate me now, 1 to 10, what is your rate? 11. <laughs> Thank you, Alex. No Alex, Thank right? Alex, yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Hi, uh, my name's Josh, and this is Danny. I'm Danny. What do you guys do for a living? We're also content creators. Nice. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Based in Manila. Nice to meet you, Jamil. Kamusta naman yung stay niyo sa Boracay Island? Uh, amazing. The beaches, the water never gets old. It's always breathtaking whenever we come over. Hindi niyo na first time sa Boracay, right? No, no, no. Yeah. Bakit Boracay Island? The beach, of course. Uh, being on the beach. The energy. And the energy. Uh, Boracay different. has the best sunsets. Mm -hmm. Have you been to like a different uh, islands in the Philippines? Yeah, we have. A couple islands. Uh, actually, my province is Basilan in Mindanao. So uh, we've been around there, uh, Visaya, Cebu, Romblon. She's from Romblon. So we've been to a lot of beaches, but nothing compares. Boracay, parin talaga. Like, what, what do you think is the similarities among those islands that na napuntahan yun? Well, it's always the Philippines. So that's basically it. As cliche as it may sound, it is not. It's really the warmth of the Filipinos that keep, I think, foreigners coming back. Iba yung hospitality talaga ng mga Pilipino. Meron ba kayong favorite place dito sa Boracay na parang gustong gusto nyo pagtambayan? Kahit saan, basta nasa beach. Pero ako, Station 1. Kasi usually hindi masyado matao sa Station 1. May mga nagsisilabasan kasi mga articles regarding Boracay and other islands na super expensive. Do you think Boracay Island is expensive? Yeah. It is. Yeah, pretty expensive. But of course, if you want a more budget option. Meron Meron din naman, yeah. diba? So it depends on where you are, where you want to eat, diba? And uh, what you want to eat, I guess. And if I would explain it to a tourist, it's really, of course, you know you're coming into a tourist destination in the Philippines. It's one of the top, if not the top destination in the Philippines. So you should know what to expect. Tips sa mga couples out there na mahilig din magbakasyon just like you guys. Tips? Travel tips ba? Travel or, tips? Oh. Or re relationship tips? Shut up. Uh, um, depends what kind, of a, what kind of travelers you are, I guess. If you're looking for a budget-friendly fun time, there's a lot of hostels here that offer a good time for, for couples and even people who, don't, who aren't couples. So single, single ladies and gents over there. Yep. The only tip I want to share, not only for couples but for everybody in general is just respect the beach bring your trash with you and oh. don't change anything yeah, respect pretty the much beach. respect the and beach. it will respect you back yeah anong pangalan mo uh, levin sir levin teka saan ka uh, mindoro sir anong work mo uh, concierge ako sir kamusta naman yung uh, work mo or kamusta naman yung pagtatrabaho mo sa barakay island uh, bali fresh graduate lang sir first step ko okay naman sir yung work ko Doon napakaswerte ko sir kasi direct ako sa land, inside. Ano sa tingin mo yung uh, similarity ng Mindoro sa Boracay Island? Malayo po eh, pero kasi napakaganda ng Boracay. Pero mayroong parte sa Mindoro na which is parang isa siyang Boracay. Ganyan din siya kasikat, hindi mang kalakihan. Ito ang Puerto Galera. Ilang taon ka na 11? Ah, sa tingin mo sir, ilan? Ginawa hmm. pa ako mahuhulan ni 11. <laughs> 22. Talaga? 23. Kaka-23 ko lang this January. Oh, belated happy birthday. 
May single si Levin, may jowa, may anak, may asawa. Jowa lang. Ilang taon na kayo? Bilang 6 years. Tagal na no? Kailan kayo paghihiwalay? Kailan? <laughs> Guys, ang gwapo ni Levin, no? i-focus mo. Para siyang model mo. Levin, tara, uwi na tayo. <laughs> <laughs> Anong pangalan mo? Rafael po. Raf, what do you do for a living? Um, professional dancer. Wow, gusto ko yung dancer. Pero hindi ako marunong magsumayaw. Let's say for example, if tuturuan mo ako sumayaw, ano ba yung mga possible na dance move na maituturo mo sa akin? Ano? Lagabog. Gusto ko yung lagabog. <laughs> <laughs> Kamusta naman yung impression mo sa isla? Uh, siguro, mainit lang talaga. Nice pa din. So, maganda yung pinagbago ng beach. Nakakabigay siya ng peace of mind. When was the last time na nag-visit ka sa Boracay? 2015. Ah, so wala pa yung rehabilitation? Yeah, wala pa. So, ano yung comparison before and now? Siguro ngayon marami na talagang tao. Before kasi, siyempre hindi pa siya well-known. Man, worth it pa rin naman pumunta dito kasi kahit crowded, marami pa rin spaces na pwede kang magsolo. Ano sa tingin mo yung meron sa Boracay Island na wala sa mga ibang isla na napuntahan mo na or tourist destinations? Ano, yung ambience din talaga. Hindi mo siya may compare pa rin talaga. Ilang taon ka na, Ralph? 21. Single? May jowa? Or complicated? Secret. Oh, alam niyo na. <laughs> very mysterious. Love loves moves in mysterious ways. Thank you, Ralph. Yeah, thank nice you, to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Upload. What is your name? Chloe. My name. Where are you guys from? UK, Wales. Wales, yeah. I love UK. <laughs> What is your first impression of Boracay? It's really nice. Love the beaches. Weather's really good. Nice food. Nice people. Is this your first time on the island? On this island, yeah. You've been here before in the Philippines? We've traveled around the Philippines for the last two months. Yeah. This is our last, this is our last stop in the Philippines. Apart from Boracay Island, which other tourist destination you've visited? Uh, we've been to Palawan and Chagao and Cebu. Yeah. And Sekiho and Boho. Wow. Which one do you do you like the most? We love Chagao. Yeah, I'd say Chagao. Like, what do you think is the comparison between Boracay, Chagao, and the other tourist destinations you've been? I think the people are all really nice everywhere. Um, I think the beaches are quite different. The food's quite different. Um, yeah, I think the people probably the similarities. Any Filipino food you tried already? Like your favorite so far? Um, Halo Halo, the ice cream. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the Halo Halo whole yeah, thing, yeah. 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 <laughs> I like the sizzling tofu. Those are amazing food, by the way. I also yeah. like that. Yeah. <laughs> If you're going to rate Boracay Island on a scale of 1 to 10, what is your rate? Give it 8.5. I'd give it a 9 out of 10. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Thank you guys so much. <laughs> you guys are